How do you describe Mass General Store to somebody that's never stepped foot in one? It's kind of like your great-grandmother's idea of a mall. <laughs> All in one place. It's everything that you need. You don't have to walk from store to store. It's everything in one place. When this, did it start? This is where it all started. Uh, it was originally built by Henry Taylor in 1883. Things haven't changed a lot since probably the 1940s or 50s. Mm -hmm. So, But it was a happening place. Uh, because just down the road, we have the Mass Store Annex, which was once a competing general store. No way. Uh, it was built in 1909, and it was actually one of the partners in it was a doctor named Dr. Perry who had his first office in a lean-to shed on the other side of this room. Got it. So um, there was tourism in the early um, 1900s. People would come and stay a month or two mm -hmm. uh, to escape the heat. Um, so this store was actually operated by the Mass family until probably the 1970s. But but there's a there's a feeling here. There's a well to use a 1970s term. There's a vibe here. How do you describe that feeling? It, it's interesting to me. There's a historian who wrote uh, a history of Watauga County in 1915, John Preston Arthur, and he said there's a dreamy spell that hangs over this little valley, and I think it's not just a spell, it's kind of a different kind of magic because when you drive that road from 105, it's, you start to slow down, you start to notice the things around you, and you're basically just transported to a different time. Got it. So we, we like to do things kind of face-to-face -face, like we're doing now. Right. Um, our guests, when they come in, we like to interact with them and ask them and truly mean it. Can we help you today? What are you looking for? Um, oh, you're looking for a gift. Who are you getting it for? Uh, let's give you some suggestions. So it's a real personal interaction. When you look at our stores, they're all a little different. Uh, they have a lot of the same merchandise, but some merchandise will be true to their town. Yeah. And um, when we go in, we want to learn the story of the building that we're in and not wipe out that story, but we want to help them continue that story. Tell that story. Well, our story continues. I need to look around. It's good to meet you. Thank you for this.